Nearly 200 earthquakes were recorded in Yellowstone National Park. Hundreds of small earthquakes have been detected at Mount Rainier. Yellowstone and Mount Rainier, America's twin volcano crisis. In what scientists are calling one of the most alarming volcanic episodes in modern history. The United States Geological Survey, USGS, has confirmed hundreds of powerful earthquakes. Swarms beneath both Yellowstone National Park and Mount Rainier in Washington. These are not isolated tremors. These are relentless, clustered quakes. A geological drumbeat echoing from deep within the Earth's crust. And they're happening at the same time. Yellowstone. The ground has been shuddering with unusual frequency. State-of-the-art seismic arrays have recorded quake after quake, some deep, others shallow, as though different layers of the Earth are shifting in unison. The park's famous hydrothermal features are behaving erratically, geysers erupting hours ahead of schedule, hot springs boiling hotter than usual, and vents releasing plumes of steam, larger than scientists have seen in years. Beneath the picturesque, forests and steaming basins lies a magma chamber so massive it stretches for tens of miles in every direction. If it were to rupture in a super eruption, the blast could eject enough ash to bury cities, disrupt agriculture worldwide, and darken skies for years. Nearly a thousand miles to the northwest, Mount Rainier is experiencing its own wave of unrest. Normally quiet, the ice-capped giant has been rattled by swarms of small but rapid-fire earthquakes over the past weeks. Some residents of nearby towns have reported hearing a faint rumble, not just feeling the ground move. Scientists are concerned because Rainier's slopes hold vast glaciers. Even a moderate eruption could melt that ice in hours. Unleashing layers, massive mud flows capable of traveling at freeway speeds, obliterating anything in their path and reaching as far as Puget Sound. The USGS has warned that Mount Rainier is considered one of the most dangerous volcanoes in the United States, not just because of its eruptive potential, but because of the sheer number of people living in its shadow. The real shock to geologists is the timing. Yellowstone and Rainier are completely different volcanic systems, separated by distance, magma source, and geological structure. Yet here they are, both trembling with intense seismic energy in the same short window of time. Some researchers 
speculate that shifting tectonic plates in the western United States could be redistributing stress across multiple volcanic regions. Others wonder if deep mantle processes could be triggering activity far apart in a rare and unpredictable chain reaction. Publicly, USGS scientists are urging calm, noting that most earthquake swarms do not lead to eruptions. Privately, however, they admit that the coincidence is unnerving. The nightmare scenario, though rare, would be simultaneous or near simultaneous eruptions from both volcanoes. An event with no precedent in recorded history. In such a case, Ash clouds from Yellowstone could smother huge swaths of North America, while Lajos and pyroclastic flows from Rainier could devastate the Pacific Northwest within hours. In emergency management offices from Wyoming to Washington, quiet preparations are underway. Evacuation routes are being reviewed, hazard maps updated, and satellite monitoring intensified. Every spike in quake frequency, every shift in ground level, every chemical change in volcanic gases is now being scrutinized in real time. For the moment, no eruption is imminent, but the restlessness is undeniable. The planet's crust is moving, ancient systems are stirring, and the eyes of the scientific world are fixed on two of the most formidable volcanoes on Earth. Whether this is a prelude to disaster or simply a reminder of our planet's power. One thing is certain, the nightmare has begun and the clock is ticking.